Mushfika had recently missed out on a ton during the Asia Cup, falling on 99 against Pakistan in the do-or-die virtual semi-final match. He said that any batsman would get nervous when batting in the 90s. There was eagerness but there was also the nervous 90s to deal with and Mushfika overcame not only his own instincts but also his nervousness. There isn't a batsman who doesn't get nervous in the 90s. If someone doesn't, he must be an angel. I think an individual's true self comes out in these moments. I am definitely trying to stay in control. My last innings of 99 was certainly in my mind. I had struck a sweep shot into short legs foot, and I didn't get a run from it, Mushfika revealed later during a press conference. T was taken when Mushfika Rahim was on 195. Five shy of becoming the first Bangladesh batsman to score two double centuries and also the first wicketkeeper batsman in Test history to strike two double tons. Within two overs of resumption he had nudged his way to 199 and was on strike at the start of the 153rd over to be bowled by leg spinner Brandon Mavuta. There was a lot of subtext surrounding the situation. He had gotten out for 99 in the Asia Cup match against Pakistan. There was also the lingering stigma of celebrating too early and letting emotions get the better of him like he had done in the last over of the 2016 World 2020 match against India, which Bangladesh lost by one run with Mushfika one of the last three wickets to fall in three balls. Lastly, there was also Bangladesh batsman's checkered history with leg spinners to consider. The first ball dipped towards the stumps and before it pitched and ripped away, Mushfika had shouldered arms to let it go through as the quarter capacity crowd let out a panicked gasp. He waited for the turn in the second ball and played it away to the packed offside infield. The next two balls were played similarly with the young Mavu to keeping his cool and landing in good areas. The fifth ball was more in Mushfika's arc and he unleashed a powerful sweep that should have gone for four, but only thudded into short legs shin guards. He calmly defended the next delivery as Mavu to completed a high-quality maiden, but none of the balls were unhittable. Mushfika could have unleashed his trademark slug sweep to at least three of the deliveries but he just knew better. The whole innings owed to the confidence in his game that told him that unless he wanted to get out, the bowling would not be able to send him off. The next ball he faced, off Sikandar Raza in the next over, he pulled away to the deep for the single and then, only then, did his emotions come out. 220 balls and roughly 24 hours after celebrating his first century, it was well worth the wait. He overcame his own eagerness and his self son troll showed. News taken from the Daily Star. Thanks for watching.